Hey guys, what's up? So it took me a day later to make a video with me on YouTube. So I'm going to explain to you what happened. Well, obviously, the Bears won thanks to Eddie Money or the Cuban Kicker or whatever you want to call him, De Niro Panero. Eddie Panero hit a 53-yard field goal. Time expired for the Bears to beat the Broncos in Denver. The Broncos are 12 and 13 in home opener games. Believe it or not, when they play at home in their new stadium, the Bears broke that record. They beat them. So here's the interesting thing about it. You guys think about Trubisky. Um, I think Trubisky is the product of play calling, and also because of that, Trubisky. It's only a third-year quarterback, second year under Matt Nagy's offense. So he's in the mercy of the play calling, as well as what the defense is going to give him. So you know how you tend to, like, oh, I'm going to go lose weight, I'm going to do this, and you're going to join the gym, and that kind of stuff, right? And then slowly and surely you go back to your old ways. No difference with Trubisky. That's what Trubisky is doing. He's sticking to his old ways. And the only way you're going to break that is you force him to uh, be better. Not just that. Now, I did a video that I recorded on my phone on the TV with my tripod. Recording the TV because I was able to match it around the rim of the television. It's not perfect. It's grainy. Of a video that I did before. It has over almost 3,000 likes. And views and I did it legally which means I did not copy it from the NFL I videotaped it from my own television in my own room my own man cave and NFL did an NFL copyright claim it the heck is that all about now I get it it's the NFL property but as a fan if you watch it and you do that on Facebook or you do that on Tumblr, if you do that on Reddit, if you do that on Twitter, NFL doesn't go after you. They only go after you if you're going to do it, selling shirts. Even then, I've seen people get away with stuff. But on YouTube, there's no mercy. So how are you supposed to be a Chicago sports channel like I am, or a sports channel on YouTube? Talk about your favorite teams and your favorite city, and don't get a copyright claim. Anyone has any advice? It's not like I'm trying to go make money off of this and try to rip off the NFL. So, I don't know. If anyone's been through it, let me know. I'll be curious. If anyone went through it, yeah, that's my flannel shirt. If you could tell over there, I threw it. It's too hot to wear. I was going to wear it, but um, yeah, I got a flannel shirt. That's perfect for bear season. It's black and orange, but perfect for Halloween and the fall, too, so... But I've gained 10 subscribers in 24 hours. Who am I to complain about? Um, so subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get 1,000 subs and 4,000 watch time hours. So I'm over 100 watch time hours. So please watch my videos and subscribe. Help me get to this. Because I'm planning to like make shirts and hats that say Chicago Sports Vlogs. This is a hat from Grassroots California. It's the Chicago a door theme or the bears theme you can tell right over here i'll flip it up so you can see see it has the bears there's the bear logo that's the chicago flag with bears colors kind of like the california flag this is a vintage 1985 believe it or not chicago bears champion shirt i'll prove it to you it's a little champion logo the chicago bears and i did a video on this before i actually got the shirt from uh glenn kozlowski and Jim McMahon. I knew both of them very well. And I'm um, still in touch with Glenn and his family. Number 88. We played with Waddle and uh, and uh, Harbaugh and Tom Zag and McMahon and all those quarterbacks. So there's that. Where do I see the Bears going for a preview? That's the next video. What are they going to do? What are their records going to be against? A Monday Night Football week from now playing in our nation's capital against the Washington Redskins. We'll see. 
So like I said, subscribe to my channel. Help me out here. I'm trying to get 1,000 subs. Maybe I was told I don't talk loud enough. So if this is loud enough, let me know. I don't have a microphone. I ordered one. See if I can get one. I can use the iPod cord, uh, the earphones. But the problem with that, they always get in the way. And I have ones that are, where are they? Um, let's see. I have ones that are here. I can test them out. Got these for Walmart for 30 bucks. They're kind of cool. They light up. It's a knockoff brand of uh, Apple AirPods, and they work pretty good, actually. I do have a main channel. Uh, my main channel is Brandon the Archivist. And that I'll do everything, travel, vlogs, stores, whatever. I did some stuff for Halloween, non-sports related, but anything to do with sports, especially Chicago sports, it's over here. But I noticed something. If I do stuff basically in the NFL, it's popular anyways. So I did several videos on that. I did the Steelers, the whole offensive line being, um, <laughs> all of them being penalized, being on holding. And then I also did the cornerback or safety from the Colts that intercepted the ball in one hand and almost ran all the way. So I did that kind of video and that had, geez, it's about to hit 3,000 views. But yeah, NFL is not fun when it comes to you trying to make a YouTube channel out of this and then you get smashed or with copyrights. And it kind of sucks, to be honest with you, because you're not trying to rip off the NFL, you're trying to cheer your favorite team, right? Or favorite teams or favorite city or favorite player that you knew since high school or even college and uh, or you grew up like I did many generations as a Bears fan so we are five generations now believe it or not so yeah bear down everybody and subscribe and like this video subscribe, subscribe to my channel I really appreciate it and check out my main channel which is Brandon the Archives and uh, it's Brandon the Archivist, so check it out. Oh yeah, I shaved my face. Yeah, whatever. I can always regrow it, right? Okay, bear down. Hey, don't give much Trubisky a hard time too. He'll do better, you'll see. He'll throw a couple of touchdowns against the Redskins. So bear down, Chicago.